Yes, it's true. I am still here. I am still reviewing Shein items. Let's get right into it. This is the Plus Striped Asymmetrical Neck Twist Hem Tee, retailing at $12. If this item isn't wonderful, I might be extremely upset because I ordered it completely by itself. Granted, there was like free shipping on orders over like a super small amount, but still, I saw this and I was like, okay, I really want that. I hope it, I hope it's beautiful. I hope it's wonderful. Cause if it's not like, seriously, I'm going to be upset. It is a bit thin, which is concerning. I really liked the whole little one cold shoulder thing. Like look, it's so cute. It is a bit on the slippery side. I'm going to assume we're looking at some polyester here. We got a little bit of a fun knot thing here. This one is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. This is the Plus Zip Back Split Hem Plaid Skirt, retailing at $12. This I definitely feel like could be something to transfer into fall with. Like, is it not cute? It, it does, it does have a bit of a see-through element. We shall see what it looks like on, but it, it's cute. <laughs> it's cute. I have problems. Okay, it's cute. And the little thing split here in the front, which is the whole split hem thingamajig. And we have our zipper here. Pretty smooth. And it's like the same color. It's so cute. It's just thin and that's what's making me worried. This one is 100% polyester. So another thing I've been seeing a lot on Shein is sets. And I kind of wasn't really gonna do it and then I was just like I want to try it so I've been doing some some of these like shirt skirt sets this one is the plus drawstring knot floral top and button front skirt set retailing for $17 so this is the floral top part very thin I will say that it's is quite thin I can see you I don't know if you can see me through that it does have a little bit of elastic stretch here at the bottom. It has this drawstring front that you can like make the, dre the dress, <laughs> the shirt kind of smaller up in the front. Probably not something I'll personally be using, but it's cute. And it comes with this skirt. All the buttons are here regardless of them not being super visible at the moment. The inside is lined, which is actually really nice. Something that can kind of get iffy sometimes <laughs> with Shein skirts is when they're not lined and they're like super thin. Definitely a color I also think I can move into fall with. The outside isn't super soft, but it's not super rough either. The inside is just fine with that lining and it is 100% polyester. We have more polka dots because of course. This is the Shein Plus polka dot layered ruffle hem top. Retailing at $13, according to this, is currently sold out. So this one is a nice long sleeve. Of course, it's got our ruffle ends. This is actually two layers of ruffle here. The outside isn't super soft, but it's not scratchy, and the inside is nice and soft. It seems like it'll probably be a bit warmer, which is nice for the weather we're having right now. This one is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. This next one is the Shein Plus Heather Knit Tiered Dress, retailing for $16. I got this one in green. I feel like the green will be really good also for the transition time. I feel like it can hold up in pretty much, I don't know, it's a good color for anything I think you know what I mean like it's not exclusively winter fall type time it could do summer but I feel like it does better just because the deeper color we have our typical short sleeve here it is nice and soft here's the tiered part this one is 60% polyester, 10% spandex, and 30% rayon. This is the Shein Plus Drawstring Hem Pants, retailing for $12. Now, like a lot of these maybe nicer looking ones, it kind of has this slightly rough outside. It's not really pleasant to put your hand across, but on the inside, it is a bit smoother. I wouldn't say it's like nice and soft like some of these, but I think that's because it's thinner. Some of the ones that are really nice and soft on the inside, I think are thicker, maybe warmer for cooler weather. This one is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. There's a pretty simple pant. It's got your elastic up here. And the real, only real difference is these little ties at the bottom, which you can pull and get kind of this effect. We'll see if these work out. I don't know, they are a bit thin. I don't know how that's gonna translate again. 
on a body. And this last one is the Shein Plus Ruffle Cuff Floral Tee, retailing at $13. So I do like this material. It is soft. It has a little bit of that slick feeling, so probably some polyester in here, I'm assuming. I'm not 100% yet. It does have this little ruffle, double ruffle kind of thing. So there's one ruffle layer here, layer here and one on this part. Now this one I did order in a 3X, I guess. Probably because it was a good deal and I thought maybe I could push it. <laughs> so we'll see how it fits. And this one is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed today's haul and my descent into madness buying things. Uh, anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and drop a like. All of the links for these products should be in my description box, so be sure to check that out if you're interested in any of these. And something I did want to note, I don't know if I said in my other videos, I doubt I did. Some of these, if they don't end up working out for me personally, or I don't just absolutely love them, I might have them on my Poshmark for a little bit, just to kind of pass a deal on to you guys, because it'll be really short shipping instead of waiting forever from China. To be fair, Shein doesn't take forever. Usually, on average, I think I've waited two or three weeks, but if you want it sooner, obviously Poshmark would be better. You've already seen the exact item and the size, etc. So I think that's pretty cool. So I will be throwing some of these on my Poshmark. I'll have that also linked if you're interested in some of these that maybe I didn't absolutely 100% love. For me, Nala is at the base of my tripod, so my camera might be moving. I hope you're having a wonderful week, and I'll see you in whenever my next video on this channel is. Bye!